today's Food for Thought comes from the fourth chapter of 1 Timothy, verses 14 through 16, which reads, Do not neglect the gift that is in you, which was given to you by prophecy with the laying on of the hands of the eldership. Meditate on these things. Give yourself entirely to them, that your progress may be evident to all. Take heed to yourself and to the doctrine. Continue in them. For in doing this, you will save both yourself and those who hear you. So what is the gift that is in you? The gift that is in you is the same gift that is in all of those that genuinely believe in Christ. Through our faith in Christ, we have received the Spirit of God, that is, the Holy Spirit. Through the Holy Spirit, we come to truly know the love of God, and we are able to then share the love of God with all of those that are around us. Through the Holy Spirit, we come to know and understand the divine truth that we again are also able to share with all of those that are around us. We are to be diligent in our faith by living by the word of God. As Paul said, we should take heed to the doctrine and we should live by the sound doctrine. And in doing so, we will save not only ourselves, but we'll save all of those that are around us if they take heed to the word. Sadly, however, so many of us, we have a spirit of fear. And that spirit of fear, it causes us to keep our gift to ourselves. The spirit, I want you to understand, it is to be expressed. It is not to be held within. When we don't share the gift within us, we begin to neglect that gift. Neglecting the gift that we have received from the Lord, it is no good for us. And it is certainly no good for all of those that are around us. So in his second letter to Timothy, Paul, he encouraged the young preacher to stir up the gift of God, which was in him. To all of you today, I express the same thing. Stir up the gift of God that is in you. Share the gift of God. Don't keep it to yourself. God, he has not given you his spirit just for you to sit down on. Share it. Share his love with all of those that are around you. Mm -hmm.